Here we make a chart of certain physical quantities which are very common. One is area. Area has a physical formula length into width. So, dimensions will be L and L that is L2. How much is the mass involved? Mass is not involved so we will write here 0. Time is not involved so we will write here 0. Normally in mechanics in mechanics we will put our formula only mentioning three basic dimensions which are dimensions of mass, dimensions of length and dimensions of time. Okay. What is the unit of area? Meter square. Okay. Volume. Volume is length into length into length. So this is m0 no mass length three dimensions and time no dimensions. So volume has dimensions of mass length and time three dimensions of length. Then comes density. Density has a physical formula mass upon volume. Now here this mass has got power plus 1 and this has got power minus 1. Now volume has dimensions L3 so this is M upon L3 and this will be M L minus 3 and there is no involvement of time. Then speed, speed is distance upon time. If it is distance upon time then distance is length and time is t. So this is L t minus 1. Then acceleration, speed upon time. Speed upon time will be L t minus 2. Momentum, mass multiplied by speed. Here comes mass and speed L t minus 2 m1 l1 t minus 2 so we don't announce 1 so this is m l t minus 2 okay this is momentum momentum is what mass multiplied by velocity this is momentum okay now force force is mass into acceleration for mass we have m acceleration is L t minus 2. Oh, here we have velocity, speed, but the speed has dimensions L t minus 1. So, in m v it should be L t minus 1. So, I will clean it, write it again. m v L t minus 1. Acceleration is Lt minus 2 and force is mass into acceleration. So for mass has the dimension m, for acceleration has the dimension Lt minus 2. So m, Lt minus 2 are the dimensions of force. This is one of very important dimension. Then work, work is force multiplied by displacement. Force has dimension m l t minus 2 and displacement has dimension 1 length more. So, this will be 2. Then energy. Energy is basically work done. So, it will have the same formula that is m l 2 t minus 2. If you write kinetic energy half m v square half has no dimension m has dimension of mass and speed has l t minus 1 if you square it l 2 t minus 2 that is here okay then pressure pressure has physical formula force upon area force is m l t minus 2 upon area l 3 so this is m l minus 2 no area is l 2 so this is m l minus 1 t 
t minus 2 this is dimension of the pressure now surface tension is force per unit length force upon length so force upon length this will come to be this force upon length is again m l t minus 2 upon length so this is m t minus 2 for surface tension so for surface tension force upon length this is m t minus 2 this is pressure and this is surface tension in this way there are hundreds and thousands of physical quantities and all physical quantities are expressed in the dimensions of fundamental quantities. So, dimension of a physical quantity expressed in the dimensions of fundamental quantities. This is known as formulas. So, these are few formulas of the given quantities here. Now, if we know the dimensions of a physical quantity, what is the use of it? where we are going to use it that we will study in the next lecture. Thank you.